This video will tell you what to do with all the stuff that we asked you to buy for math class. First is a loose leaf binder. We asked you to get five tabs, some graph paper, and some lined paper. The binder will be your portable file cabinet. In it you're going to put worksheets that we use in class, some homework, and that will be the homework that is not done in your journal, and tests and quizzes will also go into your binder, and you'll keep paper there for use in class. We also want you to bring to class a journal, and this has got to be a stitched journal, kind of like the one you see in the picture. I do not allow spiral bound or glue bound notebooks. It needs to be this kind of a journal. And it's best to have graph paper inside, but if you like you can use lined paper. And this is going to be used for class notes, classwork, and almost all homework. You're also going to need to bring a few things to class with you every day. Pencils and an eraser, some pens that are different colors from your pencils, so that means like a black, not a black pen, but a red pen or a blue pen, a ruler, a calculator, with extra batteries, index cards, about five or ten of them is fine, and if you'd like you can bring a scissors, we use those every so often. If you're using mechanical pencils, you may also want to put some additional lead in your container as well. At home, it's a good idea to have these things, a stapler with some staples, pencils and erasers, spare batteries for your calculator, and some extra paper, both lined and graph paper. There are also videos to watch on how to set up your binder, what to do with all the tabs and what to put in them, getting your class supplies organized and learning what it is that you need to bring to class, and a video on how to set up your journal. 